controversy of Vogue regarding Kylie Jenner finally launching her own clothing line, which may explain why she's been all over the fashion weeks. You know, I feel like in the last couple of seasons or something, or maybe even more, she's been attending way more fashion weeks, especially traveling to Europe, to Paris and shit, to do that sort of stuff, which she probably never did in the past. So it's clear that maybe, I thought it was more so, oh, I'm being an ambassador and I'm ramping up my presence there. But I guess the whole point of it was to kind of, you know, solidify and put some final touches on her collection, maybe do already some, you know, selling and um, or buying appointments over there because a lot of the people do that stuff when they're over there at Fashion Week and shit. But it's very interesting to see what the clothing will end up looking like because her style has sort of like evolved a lot in the last 18 months. She's kind of toned down her style a lot more it's a lot more mature um there's less going on and shit so i'm really curious to see what type of aesthetic she goes for with her clothing is it going to be you know more so trapaletti type of vibes will it be more margella um will it be more like you know vintage louis vuitton mark jacobs vibes like what sort of vibe is she type of going for when it comes to her own sort of clothes so let's see what it comes and involves it so obviously we've got an image here with a sneak peek of what we might see some red heels in this leather trench let's read the article courtesy of vogue itself it says kylie jenner has officially announced that she is launching a clothing line by simply captioning a photo meek high the reality TV star and beauty mogul posted an Instagram of herself wearing the leather trench fresh from the new collection. The label's just launched site revealed a closer look at the design, a sleek black coat featuring a high collar, cinch waist and oversized shoulders. Coming soon, the caption reads, sign up at khy.com. As of now, users can sign up for early access to the collection at a website, though no official release date has been announced. It's not surprising Jenner is launching a clothing venture, considering that most of her sisters have already you have a fashion business kim kardashian has a shapewear skims chloe has denim brand good american and pucks lauren schumann uh, reported in july that jenna was working with emma and jean gerd who worked with both chloe and kim and chris on their business um on the fashion line sherman wrote that the idea was not to be a sheen the controversial widely popular chinese fast fashion outfit but to offer something better reasonably sourced less junky less nicer looking Gerds did not um that did it got the girls don't do bargain basements so the idea i guess is to maybe do a uh more luxe version of sheen essentially like a higher grade level of sheen so it'll probably be the same stuff that we saw her wear i remember what was that really cute outfit she wore once i think during um when she went to aspen she was wearing this amazing bucket hat with this like leather jacket dress combo i think it might have been like vintage louis vuitton or something it was fucking incredible um i was surprised not i didn't see many um sheen level type sites copycat that look because that look was really great and i think it suit a lot of girls in terms of the shape as well and it kind of accentuate all the good parts that most girls would probably want to show off so maybe we'll see a lot more of that stuff so we'll see a lot of long leather skirt dress type things loads of big boots loads of big hats fur hats um loads of cozy oversized type of clothing um with a with a kind of sprinkling of chic sexiness that people can kind of vibe with as well to kind of you know mix it up and kind of be on brand with what kylie does obviously you've got the picture here of her giving us her back with the um exaggerated shoulder leather trench which is kind of a bit balenciaga a little bit vetement coded right a little bit mark jacobs coded and shit um maybe a little bit mugler coded as well but i do like the look of it as well so regardless it continues Jenna's no stranger to running a business. Let's not forget Kylie Cosmetics was launched in 2014 and repelled a TV star to a business status. It's not even her first fashion brand. Back in 2012, Kylie and sister Jenna um, started their 20 friendly label, Kendall and Kylie, though these days have become a PacSun sub brand. Based on the first impressions alone, it appears Kai will have a polished, um, what's that? It have a polished um luxurious feel reminiscent of clothes from balenciaga or Bottega veneta still it's very early to um tell quite the question is going to be blah 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 so kylie's coming into the clothing sector of things um some people are worried it's just going to be another fast fashion type of appeal or thing most likely it will be but fast fashion isn't going anywhere anytime soon um it just is what it is so either you get in line and you get in motion or you just get out the fucking way really it just kind of is what it is i'm more curious to see what kind of aesthetic what sort of design she's basically going to go for what the price point is going to be what type of retailers um what the casting is going to be like the model shoots the campaign 
Haynes. I want to see all that good stuff and that kind of vibe because that will kind of inform us a lot on is this just another cash grab? Is she, is she trying to do this as a way to kind of put something out there, scale it and then sell it? Or is this going to be like something that she sort of does, you know, um, for a very, very long time quietly and just kind of lets it kind of churn along without too much fanfare and it just kind of sells, you know, season in, season out because it's just got some good bait. Because that could be a good idea. It could just be like a really good basics alternative like you know whereas okay i need some basics in my wardrobe stuff that i know fits well from a brand i trust make my own brand staples in my wardrobe like every girl needs a long black leather coat every girl needs a pencil skirt a particular knit jumper a particular hoodie shape a particular bag whatever it may be so maybe that might be the case maybe it might be a a sort of luxury essentials type of line type of thing so let's see what happens when it does eventually launch but so far so good i'm liking the look of it and i can't wait to see what happens when it does officially launch and we get a better idea on what it all actually ends up looking like